alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to Vegas, where they do it bigger and better than any other city when it comes to the big time fights. We're at the Thomas and Mack Center with a much anticipated world championship on the line tonight. 12 rounds of heavyweights. This should be a really good matchup here tonight. All that energy that we saw it almost boiled over at the weigh-in yesterday. Now it gets to explode here in the ring. Kid Dynamite's making his way to the ring. And I know you're used to seeing many ring walks where guys are really jacked up. This isn't one of them. The Cannon's making his way to the ring right now. And he's doing so with a very business-like approach to things. Think about the great historic moments in the sport, and many times you think about the one single big punch that finished a great fight. He's the kind of fighter that can do that here tonight. Yeah, and more importantly than that, yeah, he has the power, but there's been other guys. Ernie Shavers had great power. He never won the heavyweight title. You have to have a trick to get it to the target when it's most needed, like Rocky Marziano against Ezra Charles. You know, Marziano had very little time left. His nose was split and the ref was gonna stop the fight. He had to land that punch, and he had a little trick. Started one hand, threw the other. Great counter shot by the cannon. We're seeing a lot of work to the body here early on by him. Teddy, is that a certain mentality, these guys that commit to being a body puncher? Yeah, because they understand that the body punching you know, that's not something that's glorious. That's not something that, you know, like a great left hook on the chin, bang, it gets results right away. They understand that that's something that pays off later and something you got to start early and stay with. A stabbing right hand by Kid Dynamite. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. What an excellent two-punch combo by Kid Dynamite. Keep working about it. Good shot to the head with that right hand. Kid Dynamite's combination punching here is showing you what good boxing is all about. Three punches thrown, three punches landed. Good flush, straight left hand. End of round one. Kid Dynamite's resting up after a round in where he was so very accurate. And Teddy, if you want to have one single quality out there, as an offensive fighter, accuracy is among the ones you want to have. Yeah, to be accurate, that means you have to be calm and you have to be smart, that you know that you're putting the punches in certain specific places for a reason. And boxing is not just about the strongest guys. It's supposed to be, and it usually is, about the smartest guys. Look at this, another power punch able to land. We're early on in this fight, he's going for it. Yeah, you wonder if he's got a call waiting outside. Good looking uppercut that time. That was a miss by Kid Dynamite. Halfway through round number two. Oh, veteran move, counter shot to the head. 
Teddy, I've heard you say it many times before, but the better fighters have a wide array of punches. Yeah, well, you have to because obviously your opponent is going to adjust to what you're doing. You want to keep them off balance. Stay effective. Good scoring shot. It was a straight right. Trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. Good flush shot upstairs. The cannon's movement helped out there. He avoided that punch. Kid Dynamite's opponent knows exactly what the game plan can be now. That counter punch landed with some success. The cannon's really impressing us here tonight. That last round, boy. He was on catch. top of his game and all catch. over his opponent. Laid out some serious damage there. Yeah, I noticed that he's starting to land that uppercut a little bit. The only thing that I wouldn't be satisfied with what he did the last round, I would just look forward for confidence to do more as sort of a good roadmap to maybe even get a knockout victory here. Put something on top of those uppercuts. You know the uppercut's landing. Now put something up top. He digs in with a left hand to the body. Well off the mark by Kid Dynamite. Wow! That is it. Gone. See ya. You are done. Out of here. Fight over. One punch over. By way of knockouts, your winner and new champion of the world, Kid Dynamite. I never saw that coming, an early knockout victory. That's a stunner, Teddy. So as I look at it, maybe not as surprising as everybody else is because he came out very dry, no sweat on him at all, and he got caught cold. A yeah, good one for the fans. Glad you tuned in to see it with us. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside...